Hello everyone. Today we're going to take a quick walk around look at this 2014 Dodge Journey Limited. This Journey is in bright silver clear coat metallic. Has the black and pearl leather interior with a tangerine accent stitching. This vehicle is all wheel drive. It is powered by the 3.6 liter Pentastar variable valve timing V6 engine. Has the 6 speed 62 TE auto stick automatic transmission. And this vehicle does have the park sense rear parking sensors. It was a dual tip bright polished exhaust tips. It is equipped with a park view backup camera which activates with reverse and has stationary guidance lines. LED rear tail lamps. This vehicle is equipped with third row seat. Nineteen inch polished chrome aluminum wheels on two twenty five fifty five R nineteen Kumo Solus tires. This vehicle does have a power sunroof. And up front you have automatic headlamps and fog lamps. Chrome grill crosshairs. And this vehicle is equipped with remote start. To operate is easy, just double press the remote start button on the key fob. And locking and unlocking the vehicle is easy with Chrysler's Smart Key Access System. It's a keyless center and go. By keeping the key fob in your purse or pocket, you're able to lock the vehicle by locating the chrome button on the door handle. The horn will chirp and the vehicle will lock. To unlock, simply grab the handle as you'd open it. And inside, we have power heated mirrors, power windows, and power door locks. So you can see it is the black with the pearl leather. Tangerine contrast stitching throughout. Molded bottle holders in the door panels. It is equipped with the Alpine Premium Sound System. Six-way power driver's seat with four-way adjustable lumbar support. Manual seat back adjust. Tangerine stitching or include, or continues upon the seats and the head restraints. Automatic headlamps and fog lamps. Instrument panel dim. Satin silver trim throughout. Leather wrapped tilt and telescoping steering wheel with integrated audio controls. Alright, pan through the interior and just show a little more details. The satin silver trim continues on the steering wheel. You can add Bluetooth controls and voice command controls, as well as your trip computer controls. Also, a cruise control. This vehicle currently has 44,876 miles on it. Moving down the center stack, 8.4 inch touchscreen display. It is equipped with Garmin based navigation. You've also got controls for heated seats, your heated steering wheel, and your power outlet. It is equipped with the AM FM and Sirius XM satellite radio. You've also got your Uconnect inputs for compact disc, Bluetooth, USB, and auxiliary input. And moving down, you have your redundant controls for audio and climate controls, volume and tune, fan speed, driver and passenger temperature controls. Below that, SD card slot and a single CD slot. Illuminated front cup holders. Nice amount of storage in your center armrest with a removable liner. 12 volt power point. You've also got Uconnect input, so your USB and auxiliary input jack.
All right, looking overhead, power sunroof control, as well as a sunglasses holder, and a convex interior observation mirror. Aimable LED map lights for the driver and passenger. And on the driver's side sun visor, a three channel Homelink Universal Garage door opener, little ticket holder. Illuminated vanity mirrors on the sun visors. Sun visors are also sliding. Automatic dimming rear view mirror with the Uconnect microphones. And looking at the rear seat, very convenient wide opening 90 degree doors for the rear seats. This is the second row seat as this vehicle does have three rows of seating. Has the easy entry system. The middle row seat seats three across. It is a 60-40 split folding seat with reclining seat backs. High adjustable head restraints on the all seating positions. The tangerine stitching continues. The fold down center armrest in the center portion of the seat with cup holders. Overhead reading lights. Rear climate control. 12 volt power point and the 115 volt 150 watt household style AC outlet. Molded grocery bag hooks in the seat backs as well as a seat back mat pocket. Storage continues in the floor on the outboard seats. Nice deep wells. And gaining access to the third row seat is easy. Located in this lever here at the top of the seat. And the third row seat. It does seat two. It is a 50-50 split folding seat with high adjustable head restraints. We've also got cup holders. Tangerine stitching on the headrest, reading lights, and ceiling mounted air vents. All right, looking at the luggage area. With the third row seat up, the luggage area is modest. However, it is usable. A nice amount of storage underneath the uh, floor mat. Jack and tools underneath that section. And you also have your cargo net organizer. A couple tie-down hooks. 12 volt power point. A little trim mounted flashlight that recharges. Very handy to have. However, folding the seats is very easy in this vehicle. Pulling these top tethers up here releases the head restraints and allows the seat back to fold. Pretty much a one-handed operation. And of course, to get your seats back, just pull up on the tethers. Put your headrest back in place. And 
There you go. All right, this does conclude our quick walk around look at this 2014 Dodge Journey Limited all-wheel drive. If you have any questions or would like to see this vehicle, please contact our showroom. One of our friendly sales staff will be more than happy to answer any questions you may have. And as always, thanks for watching.